Imagine a YouTuber who's taken over the platform by breaking records and changing lives. Meet Mr. Beast. He's the most subscribed individual creator with over 200 million fans worldwide. And when it comes to giving back, he's unmatched. From a million dollar giveaway in one video to handing over entire islands, houses, and life-changing prizes, he's a force for good too. Leading team trees to plant over 20 million trees, one of YouTube's largest charity movements ever. His success isn't just about views, it's about reinvestment. Mr. Beast pumps over $3 million a month back into his videos to make each one bigger and better, pushing his creativity and budgets to new heights. And that's not all. He created the world's most expensive YouTube video, a $3.5 million Squid Game recreation that left viewers worldwide in awe. This is the story of how a teenage dream turned into a YouTube empire, revolutionizing content creation and philanthropy on a massive scale. Let's dive into the incredible journey of Mr. Beast. Let's rewind to 2012. Jimmy Donaldson, a teenager with big dreams and just a camera, began his YouTube journey. But it wasn't always the Mr. Beast we know today. At first, he tried different types of channels, posting under names like Beast5TY and Mr. Beast6000, trying his hand at gaming, funny skits, and quirky challenges. In 2013, after nearly a year of uploads, Jimmy earned his first dollar from YouTube ads. It was small, but it meant his dream was possible. He kept going, posting tirelessly and experimenting with different types of videos. By 2014, he hit his first 100, a major milestone that fueled him to keep pushing. It took me 75,000 views to make my first $100 off of YouTube. Still, making a living was far from easy. It's been a month since I uploaded to YouTube, and to be honest, I was pretty sure I was done with YouTube. His channel had barely any traction, and he was reinvesting everything just to keep it going. It was a slow grind. In 2016, Jimmy went all in. He dropped out of college to bet everything on YouTube, facing skepticism from his family and friends. But he was committed. Relentlessly experimenting, he pushed himself to understand every detail of YouTube's algorithm. Little did he know, a breakthrough was just around the corner. In 2017, after five years of relentless effort, Jimmy finally cracked the code. He went viral with a simple yet genius video, counting to 100,000, something no one had ever done before. This was the first of many extreme challenges. I'm about to count to 100,000. You don't believe me? Just watch this video. 100,000. Jimmy began to think bigger and bolder, spending his early YouTube earnings on attention-grabbing stunts like reading the dictionary and watching paint dry for hours. As his views skyrocketed, so did his income. By late 2017, Jimmy was earning over $10,000 a month, allowing him to reinvest in bigger videos and take his content to the next level. But Jimmy wasn't just about the money, he wanted to make a difference. In 2018, he began using his earnings to give back, donating thousands to people in need, surprising strangers with cash, and even helping friends pay off debts. This is not clickbait. I am going to give a random homeless guy $10,000 robbed or something. So do you have like a bank account or something you can put it in? These videos became an instant hit, capturing millions of views and sparking a new era of charitable content that would define his brand. What's up guys? We have tons of money right here, like $20,000. We have a drone. Drone them. With each viral hit, Jimmy was able to dream even bigger. From counting stunts to massive challenges, he was on the path to okay, becoming Chris, a YouTube really icon. Here, have one hour to spend forty thousand dollars. All right, let's do this. Da, 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 da. Here's five thousand dollars. Hey. Five thousand dollars. Record everything. Give me. All right, that was good. Two, one. All right, it's been an hour. It's been an hour. So is this forty thousand dollars? So minus two couches, a plane ticket, a fence, and also our person who wasn't here today. We have forty thousand dollars worth of stuff. A channel. In 2018, Jimmy elevated YouTube content to a new level by focusing on philanthropy. We just got this house and we're giving it to a homeless person. This rate literally takes a package. I think we went a little too big. There's no such thing as two days. <laughs> Brother Bobby, how was your day? Beautiful, beautiful. Y'all made it. You made my day. This one? Yeah. yeah. Chandler, what's, what is this? I don't know. 
It's like a door. Yeah, <laughs> to his new apartment. Yeah. So this right here is your oh, kitchen. Is this yes, sir. Here. You like your new kitchen? Man. Instead of flashy stunts, he directed his growing earnings to causes that truly mattered. He didn't just stop at helping individuals. Jimmy aimed to tackle larger scale issues. In one video, he adopted every dog in a shelter to ensure they found loving homes. In 2019, Jimmy's philanthropy scaled up. He bought an entire grocery store's worth of food and donated it to food banks, helping thousands of families in need. Hey, Mr. Beast here. Today we're gonna buy every item in this store. So you get the gist of the video. We're basically buying literally everything in this store. So now we're putting everything in boxes. Like this is a candy box, so it's easier for the food bank that we take all this supplies to, to like sort it and store. Give it back! Oh my god. I'm confiscating these. Can I have one? Later that year, he partnered with Mark Robber for Team Trees, a massive environmental campaign that raised over $22 million to plant 20 million trees worldwide. From providing financial relief to food banks to supporting environmental causes, Jimmy was showing the world that YouTube could be a platform for positive change. By the end of 2019, Jimmy was more than a YouTuber. He was a movement, inspiring millions to make a difference, one act of kindness at a time. By 2020, Jimmy's vision had gone global. With his main channel surpassing 50 million subscribers, he launched localized versions of his content in Spanish, Portuguese, and other languages to reach even more fans worldwide. Building on his success, Jimmy ventured into the business world. He launched Mr. Beast Burger, a virtual restaurant chain that spread like wildfire, operating in over 1,000 locations across the U.S. and internationally. Then came Feastables, his own snack brand, offering quality chocolate bars while promoting a mission of giving back. A portion of the profits went towards supporting various charitable initiatives. Jimmy also brought his philanthropic style to global challenges. He donated millions to international relief efforts, including providing supplies and food aid to disaster-stricken areas. And his viral videos only grew in scale. From recreating the Squid Game series with a $3.5 million production budget to giving away islands, Jimmy continued to break records while using his platform to help others. By the end of 2022, Mr. Beast had become the most subscribed individual creator on YouTube with over 100 million subscribers. His empire now included philanthropy, business ventures, and groundbreaking entertainment. Mr. Beast didn't just dominate YouTube. He redefined what it means to be a creator. His success wasn't just measured by views or subscribers, but by the lives he impacted. He built an empire. With his channels earning an estimated $54 million in 2021 alone, Jimmy reinvested nearly every dollar into bigger projects and greater impact. His financial success wasn't just about wealth. It was about leveraging it to make a difference. From multi-million dollar donations to founding businesses that employed thousands, Jimmy's philosophy was simple. Create, give back, repeat. With over 100 million subscribers and billions of views, his ventures like Mr. Beast Burger and Feastables became revenue-generating machines, earning millions annually while supporting his charitable goals. Jimmy's journey wasn't without its challenges. Reinvesting almost all his revenue meant operating on razor-thin margins. Great question. Literally put on me the entire time when I used to make yeah. like a dollar a day. I saved up for months and I bought a microphone way worse than this microphone. <laughs> and then uh, I saved up for like half a year and I bought a computer. So I was recording and editing on my iPhone uh, when I first started and then I got a microphone you could plug in that I got a computer to edit on. And then after like two years of just filming on my phone, I had a hundred plus thousand subscribers but I still did have a camera because those things cost like a thousand bucks. So then I bought a camera. And after that, I bought monitors for my computer. And I just kept going and reinvesting. And then I tipped pizza delivery people a hundred bucks. And then I tipped a homeless man 10 grand. And then, you know, gave away cars, gave away houses. And last hand, take, take hand off a million dollars keeps it. And basically the entire time. So like for the last, I just did that every single month. And it just kept getting bigger and bigger. And here we are. But he believed the risk was worth the reward, and the results speak for themselves. By 2024, Mr. Beast had grown from a teenage dreamer to one of the most influential creators in history, earning accolades not just for his success, but for proving that wealth is most powerful when shared. 
In 2024, Mr. Beast achieved a staggering 60 billion views across all his main channels, generating an estimated $300 million from ad revenue alone. But that's just part of the story. Jimmy's additional channels, Beast Philanthropy, Mr. Beast Gaming, Beast Reacts, and Mr. Beast 2, have collectively racked up over 30 billion views, bringing in another estimated $120 to $180 million in ad revenue. On top of YouTube income, his businesses have been groundbreaking. Mr. Beast Burger has served millions of customers, generating $150 million in revenue, while Feastables crossed $100 million in sales in just two years. With sponsorship deals, merchandise sales, and other partnerships, Mr. Beast's total estimated wealth surpasses $1 billion. His rise to billionaire status reflects not only his ability to entertain, but also his talent for building a multifaceted empire. If it was Mr. Beast recently turned down a $1 billion offer for his YouTube channel. He said maybe if it was 10 or 20 billion, I'd even consider it. Do you think that he made a bad call? Well, let's do some basic math. His most viewed video is 293 million views. That's the $456,000 Squid Game. Super Bowl commercial, you do 30 seconds. What are you paying? $5.2 million. And Super Bowl gets roughly 100 million views. He's got a total of 17 billion views. 17 billion views divided by 100 million because that's what Super Bowl claims. So that's 170 times 5 million bucks. His one channel alone has generated a minimum of $850 million and I'm calculating only one commercial and then add it to all the other channels that he has. I think he's right, 10 or $20 billion is the right number. Thanks for watching and see you soon for a new topic. Do not forget to hit that subscription button to help us grow. Bye-bye.